Maybe this was the mysterious Mr. Right I'd been waiting my whole life to meet. Bits! <laughs> Mother, I do not need a blind date, particularly not with some verbally incontinent spinster who smokes like a chimney, drinks like a fish, and dresses like her mother. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Ah, oh, Natasha. This is Bridget Jones. Bridget, this is Natasha. Natasha is a top attorney and specializes in family law. Bridget works in publishing and used to play naked in my paddling pool. There was a young woman from Ealing who had a peculiar feeling. She lay on her back and opened her crack and pissed all over the sea. What a shame you couldn't bring your boyfriend, Bridget. What's his name? David? Darren? Daniel Cleaver. Oh. Is he a friend of yours, Mark? Absolutely not. I hope he's good enough for our little Bridget. I think I can say with total confidence, absolutely not. In London at a party last night, so I'm afraid I'm a bit hungover. Wish I could be lying with my head in the toilet like all normal people. <laughs> New Year's resolution, drink less. Oh, and quit smoking. Packet of embassy, please. I'm sorry, I'm not quite fit. Good afternoon. Lord have mercy, I'm about to burst. Hi. Wait a minute, he's back. All right, Cleaver, outside. <laughs> I'm sorry? Outside? Uh, should I bring my dueling pistols or my sword? I'm gonna get the fuck up out of here, shit, I'm out. Uh, hang on. You know, thank you. You give the impression of being all moral and noble, and normal, and helpful in the kitchen. But you're just as bad as the rest of them. Well, I can see that I've been laboring under a misapprehension. Very, very foolish mistake. Forgive me. One hour later. Sorry, can I just take one moment? Thank you for inviting me. I didn't. It must have been my parents. Okay. Still going out without publishing, <laughs> Charlie? Uh, no, no. Oh. You once said that you like me just as I am, and I just wanted to say likewise. I mean, you wear stupid things your mum buys you. Tonight's another classic. <laughs> You're haughty, and you always say the wrong thing in every situation. And I seriously believe that you should rethink the length of your sideburns. <laughs> Right.